this is the best ASMR I've ever seen. Yeah, pretty close. It is really pretty close to the point where I've been obsessed with... Obsessed with it. Now we all know that ASMR is satisfying. That is a, an essential aspect of ASMR. And has been, I would say, probably since the very beginning. I have not ever seen anything as satisfying as this. And it is 100% unintentional. All right, everyone, here we are at the end of the Thirsty Tree Culvert. Camera number two is now going. If you've ever seen this before, now it's very possible you'll know immediately what we're talking about. Right here, because two thirds of it are blocked. There might not be really any blockage at the entrance. Now this person, this, whose name I'm going to link in the uh, and it may release description, post 10. It like it's be a fun one. Just seems like a cool guy. Fun part about it is it's very much like just literally making me reevaluate my entire life, and I'm like, man, you know what? Let me see if I can get a job down at the uh, the DOT. Oh my god, it's so nice. It's unbelievable. Now this video in particular is a little bit less of a gradual working towards something and then, you know, there's little payoff, little payoff, little payoff, little payoff. This one is actually very much kind of a, kind of a tease for a while. You think you're getting progress, but you're not. See, like that, oh, oh. But no, not really doing it. Not really doing it. The other ones are, are much more gradual, interesting stuff that you'd see. Almost best appreciated in like a time last. Still really good though. Still, still love it. But again, this is the first video of his that I watched. And now I'm just like watching, you know, hour and a half long cuts raw, unedited part of Beaver Dam uh, to the point where I'm just I'm trying to figure out how I can do something like this I don't think I'm going to be able to do it at the scale he's doing you know with like actual culverts and actual you know beaver dams and these types of things for one I don't have access to a car but still Is it pulsing or anything? It seemed like he was yeah, talking. I was actually wondering if he's talking it's to somebody. I don't think so. Oh no, this. This one's under a lot of pressure. This one. Oh my god. This this move right here. This is making me. I love it. The like pushing on it. I love 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 it. Yeah, but you see, like, again, it actually is not really going to move anything. You're just, like, hoping it's kind of shifting. It's gonna, it's gonna, you know, you're gonna let the water pressure bust a hole one way or another. And then it's gonna actually start working. Doing it by hand might be the way to go. Yeah, get in there. I don't know, personally, I think he had, I think he had the right idea of jamming the stick in and then crowbarring it and pulling out little bits like that. I think that was probably the actual correct way to go. I would have done more of that. But yeah, the pushing on it technique, that's pretty cool. You know? Because you're actually... See? Yeah, you're hoping that the pressure's gonna be actually pushing it out. Look at that pressure. You're actually hoping for that, that, like, pushing it is gonna, like, basically just, you know, build up the pressure enough that it just pops everything out. 
see. Yeah. 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 Two. I think so. I think it did. I think it helped. Oh, but it's good though. I wouldn't worry about it that much. I mean, you've got so much pressure here. Now, granted, I think they probably could I think I'm seeing the end in sight, maybe. cut a little bit of this tree back. Oh, there we go, I think. oh yeah, good lord. Look at all of those leaves. Oh my god. Look at those. Oh my god. Seriously, that's unbelievable. Wow! Unbelievable. That's the best we ever seen here. That is incredible. The other side of that is my god. The amount of pressure, the amount of water moving down there. Unbelievable. Unfreaking believable. Oh my god, I love it. I feel like I'm rowing in here with commentary, but I couldn't think of literally anything else today. It's just like, oh man, alright, how can I replicate this? How can I attempt to do something as good as this? Oh, I don't know. Oh my goodness. That's so good. So good. supposed to be getting diverted here. Interesting. It's supposed to be going through the other pipe. Yeah. I would imagine so, because I mean, that a huge tree right there. We're all good. We'll come take another look at this pipe. I feel like they could, the they could chunk out a little bit. Completely stop flowing. Oh my god, yeah. So I think it's possible they could have chunked out a little bit of that tree stump to stop it from blocking off. 
that's a possibility, but jeez, my god, I mean, that's like legit, that's, so, that's like the most satisfying thing I've ever seen in my entire life, <laughs> yeah, again, so much so that I'm watching like hour and a half, just, you know, grinding away at a, at a beaver dam, and, you know, not getting nearly as much like super satisfying explosions, but just like, really fun, good images, and it's also, like, you know, it's just, like, beautiful natural scenery that I actually probably wouldn't enjoy nearly as much in real life because, you know, you're going to be dealing with bugs, you're going to be dealing with, you know, swamps, you're going to be dealing with smells, all that kind of stuff, but it just makes me want to get back out into the woods and, like, you know, tromp around and, you know, build up dams, tear them down, all kinds of stuff really good, fun, nostalgic stuff, and so unbelievably satisfying, so seriously, I would imagine, the guys that got almost a million subs, I would imagine you've checked them out, but if not, 